been a couple weeks you know what that means garden update um, this one's gonna be quicker I'm realizing these videos are kind of long and they take a long time to upload so just real quick you know all about the San Marzano it's a new planter starting to get some good maters in here check these out I don't even know if I can find them probably not there's a couple of cantaloupe under here there's two of them right there I don't know if you can see those or not there's two of them and there's two back here one of them's getting pretty big that thing's sweet but the cantaloupe plant is like taking over the yard I love it um, cucumbers we're getting ready to make some pickles um, we've already we've already picked probably 20 good cucumbers off of this plant and there's hundreds more to come run down here See the Trinidad scorpions. There are gonna be so many peppers on this plant. Can you see back in there? Uh, if you look at the top of it, there's at least a hundred on here. This plant looks terrible, but it's given me the most peppers. Those are all ghost peppers and most of those flowers and little hanging things you see will turn into peppers too. Some of them just drop off. Um, geez, what is that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen dozen good peppers on there. Not even gonna bother with the herbs. Trying to keep this short and sweet. The oregano's had a monarch butterfly on it all day, though. That's pretty cool. Uh, the watermelon plant. It's about seven feet long now, but it's kind of stalled, growing a little bit. I don't know if you can see that or not, but we have one watermelon on it. I'll take it, though. There, there should be more. The pumpkin patch. Look how big this thing's getting. That's that vine alone is six feet long, and it keeps all this other stuff keeps like invading the neighbor's yard. So I keep like bending it back, and then I grab a hold of the fence, and I just keep it on my side of the property. Nothing. Lots of flowers. Nothing. Uh, Nothing you can call a pumpkin yet, though. But this plant's enormous. It's been a lot of fun to grow, even if it don't get a pumpkin. These sand marzanas need trimmed a little bit, get some of this dead stuff off the bottom. Um, but otherwise, there's there's got to be over a hundred tomatoes here, or probably anyway. I mean, look at this bunch. A dozen right there, right there. There's another big bunch down there. Jeez. Uh, and the usuals. Pepper Pig, looking beautiful. Our own Seed Habanero, looking a lot better. Another Ghost Pepper plant. This one's been really slow. It gets overwatered because all the water runs down to this corner and it turns into a puddle. Um, Oh, you see some bunches of marzanos in here. And then let's look, let's look down here. Ugh, look at this. That's a reaper. Carolina reaper, all wrinkly and nasty. There's a few of them in there. Well, told you I'd keep it short.